So it's like a whole new day, and I spent a good portion of yesterday trying to map all this stuff out and where to put everything, kind of make it all fit in a certain way. And it just wasn't happening the way I wanted it to, and I was getting kind of like discouraged or like frustrated. I just decided to start hooking stuff up, start, start wiring things up, start putting stuff in certain places, and then it all just started coming together. So I think I'm gonna continue with that method and then just start trying different things. And if it doesn't work, then it doesn't work. But I think I'm just wasting too much time getting caught up in trying to make sure I do it right the first time. Cause I mean, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just kind of trying to think out as much of it as I can. And inevitably I'm gonna get some of it right. Inevitably I'm gonna get some of it wrong, but I just have to keep trying. Trying and failing and trying and failing. Yeah, so that we're gonna continue with that method. So far I've got the power inverter here, I've got the on off switch, I've got fuse blocks number one, charge controller, circuit breaker, batteries, we're gonna have two more right here. So yeah, let's come together. So I've got all my components hooked up, or at least mounted. Now I just need to start running some wires. So I think I'm gonna start doing that. I'm gonna see if I can't uh, use this two gauge wire and hook up my power inverter to our bus bars. And then hook up the charge controller and the stuff for the solar. I just wanna start like kind of buttoning this up because now that everything is mounted, start running some wires and put some power into this bus. It is pretty neat starting to see this like come together and all the stuff that I've done a bunch of research on and like how it actually works and it's really not as bad as I thought. And I always heard that, but then you start seeing it like, there's no way I can do that. And then you just figure it out. So yeah, let's build some, uh, let's make some cables. with how this is all turning out. It's all like super organized and very clean. And I mean, I've got like 30 formal wires to kind of tuck into this thing, but even Emily said it looks clean and simple that she could probably even figure it out. So I've got this like back barrier wall. So I'm gonna run these solar wires actually attached to the panels. I'm gonna tuck them through here, through the boards and uh, kind of make it all nice and hidden. So here we go. I, uh, I'm pretty happy with how that all kind of looks, but it's taken a lot longer than I anticipated, which is, I should just get used to that. But uh, I'm gonna start kind of continuing to wire a lot of this stuff up. So the next video will be that, me just kind of like plugging in all this stuff because we've got we've got living room lights, kitchen lights, bedroom lights, um, bathroom lights, hallway lights, 12 volt fans, exterior lights, all this stuff that needs to be plugged in. So I appreciate you guys watching. Like it if you like it, dislike it if you don't like it. And if you could subscribe, we'd really, really appreciate it. And uh, if you guys have any questions or like something you want me to clarify or any input on any of this stuff, um, please comment below. I'd love to help. But uh, yeah, appreciate it, guys.